and this should be a lot of fun. Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So it is actually past midnight. I actually have Igor here with me and I just thought I'd bring her out to say hello because she's always sleeping when I film. She is a hamster and hamsters are nocturnal. So I never really get to bring her out to show her to you guys. And I thought since she was out, I would take this opportunity to show you how she's doing. She's gotten quite large. She's actually grown a lot and she's looking really great. She's really, really cute and up all night making noise, running on her wheel. So there she is. But yeah, you guys have asked me a million times to do a feeding my tarantulas at night video because like hamsters, tarantulas are also nocturnal, which means they're going to be more active at night. These are hornworms, which are commonly called gummy worms over here. In my area of the internet and we're gonna go ahead and feed I think I have okay we have nine tarantulas and two scorpions and yeah let's just go ahead and get right into it I'm kind of curious how this is gonna turn out because I don't normally film at 12 30 a.m. let's hope they all eat and I didn't stay up this late all for nothing so let's go ahead and start out with some smaller ones first now, don't think that these small ones are going to be boring because this is my Xanthus immunis. Basically, this is probably one of my most feisty tarantulas, even though it's still super small. So let's see, I want to find it a pretty nice worm. Oh, I think this one will be perfect. And we're just going to wiggle it. There we go. I think this is its first hornworm ever. And this is also the slowest takedown I've ever seen it have. You see? Oh, there we go seemed a little confused but of course we had it under control because we are tiny and absolutely ferocious <laughs> moving on to a couple more ferocious ones we have one of my personal favorites my pamphibedius species machala and she is of course out on the prowl i hope she's hungry let's test it out and see <laughs> awesome Hopefully this is what it's going to be like the whole video and everyone's going to eat and it's going to be worth it for staying up this late. I'm going to give her a little refill really quick. There we go. And now she is all taken care of and we can go ahead and feed her neighbor down here. This is my Saracopilma rubronitans. So this one's a pretty spicy little sling as well or juvenile, I guess. We'll go ahead and try feeding like right there. Oh, she definitely notices it. See those little paws down there? It's a blue raspberry gummy worm. Maybe if I just like poke it. Oh. <laughs> So yeah, she took it too. No problem. Maybe this was a really good idea. Let's go ahead and step it up to something a little bit bigger. We will try feeding this girl. Oh, no, 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 don't run away. This is my Afonopilma uetum, and this worm is crawling right on out. So we're gonna go ahead and try this one. Yes! That was a great catch. I am very impressed so far with all of these takedowns. What do you guys think? Do you think this was a good idea? It was your idea, so I'm gonna guess you do like this idea. Okay, so let's backtrack it a little bit. So this one is Peaches, and she is my one-legged Brachypilma Hamori. Pretty little girl we rescued a while back. So let's try to get some one petapalp feeding action, and I want to get a nice good close-up so you guys can see how she does it with just one. Oh, no problem there. There she is, one petapalp and all, took it down, no problem. She does seem to use this front leg right there as her like petapalp, I guess. And yeah, that's what she uses to aid herself in eating. Okay, so, so far we've had everyone eat. We've had some really good luck so far. So now I'm going to test our luck and we're gonna try to feed my M. Robustum female who is very exceptionally shy and coincidentally very far back in her burrow. I just saw her right over here. I see her out almost every night. So I'm like really determined to get her on video eating. All right, guys, I'm going to try. I'm telling you she's the one who's going to ruin our streak. Oh, I did. I did. I scared her. Look. 
There's her butt. Okay, I'm gonna try again. I am going to guess she will not come get it on camera, but I have a feeling she will eat it. So we're gonna leave her alone and see if she uh, comes back to it before we finish recording today. Okay, my green bottle blue. I'm kind of confused. I see a molt in here and I'm wondering if she already molt again. Oh my goodness. She's huge. I think she did. I think I'm gonna rehouse her soon. Look at her. I, I think maybe I'll, oh. I have some more tarantula cribs enclosures. I can do a rehouse video and rehouser. That will be a lot of fun. In the meantime though, let's give her a good meal. A big, delicious blue meal. <laughs> Never fails. Get some light on her, check her out. Gorgeous, yes, definitely deserving of a new enclosure. I think we'll give her a really cool one considering she's going to need stuff to web up. But yeah, let's go ahead and leave her alone for now and that will be a fun rehousing video we can do soon. Okay, of course we have to try feeding my favorite tarantula. This is my S. Hoffmani, female. She's right on in there and she'll probably come out, I hope. We'll just go with this one, this one's good. All right, let's see if she'll come get it. Maybe if I just like yeet it. Yeet. Oh, okay. Oh, there she goes. Yeah, he's like I want it, but I don't feel like being on camera right now. That's fine But I think somebody is on camera. Look at this <gasps> Did she take it? I think she did. I don't want to scare her away There she is she did take it Very cool and that butt is up in the air ready to kick Scary pokey hairs at me <laughs> So since she ate, that means all the tarantulas have eaten besides one I haven't fed yet. Oh my goodness. So this is my Brachypelma smithy. True Brachypelma smithy. Not a Hamori. Butt is right there. I'm very not happy about that. Please don't kick me. Let's give her a refill. All right. I don't know. Maybe she'll eat. I don't know. Let's try feeding her, I guess. I'll put it down by her mouth. Yes, definitely interested. Oh, the suspense. There we go. It is a pretty gentle takedown, but she got it. Oh, blue juice. Blue juice. Cool. So that means all of the tarantulas that we fed today did eat, but we still have two scorpions to try to feed. So let's see how that goes. Okay, so first up, this is my flat rack scorpion. You guys really don't see this often, and honestly, neither do I. Let's go ahead and um, do something cool. Oh my goodness, I can't see anything. Turn this light on, and this should be a lot of fun. Oh, there we are. Check it out. That rock scorpion, and it's very shy, pretty much never comes out. And look at it glow under that light, so cool. So yeah, let's go ahead and try to feed it. I'm gonna turn the light back on though so we can get a better look. What do you think of that? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, it's got it. <laughs> what are you doing? Just try eating it. Come on. It wants to go back under a rock. There we go. Now it can go back under the rock if it wants. I don't think it's going to eat on camera, but I definitely think that it's gonna eat. So let's go ahead and give it its privacy. But yeah, really cool. I'm glad you guys got to see it. Okay, so we have one more to feed today and that is my Asian forest scorpion. It's right down there. Check it out, 
super cool. And this actually ate yesterday, so it's probably not hungry, but I'm gonna try to feed it anyway because, I don't know, I haven't given it a hornworm in like ever, and I think it'd be fun to try. So let's go ahead and give it a try. Let's see if it likes it. Yeah? Okay, so maybe it does want it. I really want to get a shot of Jinx eating because like their jaws are like so weird looking and I just want you guys to be able to see them. Literally looks like a nightmare. There we go. It's starting. Well, it was about to. Oh. Oh wow, we got some sting action. Finally, we got it. Check out that crazy mouth action. They have like tiny pinchers in their mouth. That is it. We fed everyone and everyone ate. Some of us are just a little shy and we decided to eat later, but that's okay because everybody ate and that was a lot of fun and I hope you guys had a lot of fun and you enjoyed it. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Tonight's video, like this video if you did, subscribe if you're not, and you want to be. Don't forget I have an Instagram that is probably way too much. I'm tired. Don't forget I have an Instagram that is probably way too much. It's at tarachula.cat. You can go follow me there. I also have a podcast, a Teespring, and a Patreon. It is all linked down below, and I will see you guys soon. Stay well.